And Australian counter-terrorism police have searched two homes in support of New Zealand police's investigation. This house, uh, in fact, are linked to the gunman who is uh, charged in the mass shootings of about 50 people in New Zealand's uh, mosques. A police searched a home in the New South Wales town of Sandy Beach. They searched another home in Lawrence, New South Wales. The two houses are near the town of Grafton, where the accused Brenton Tarrant grew up. A police said they were trying to obtain evidence that may help them in the investigation. Australia's Home Affairs Minister Peter Dutton has said that uh, Tarrant had spent only 45 days in Australia over the past three years. And he was in fact uh, not on any terror watch lists. The police also said that the family of the Australian suspect continues to assist police with their inquiries. Meanwhile, a man and a woman who claimed to be Tarrant's grandmother and uncle spoke to a local Australian channel. The woman who identified herself as a Mary Fitzgerald said that she couldn't believe that Tarrant would do something like this. The man who identified himself as Terry Fitzgerald said he couldn't believe it until he saw Terrence's photo in the media. We're all gobsmacked. We don't know what to think. It's, um, you know, the media is saying he's planned it for a long time, so he's obviously not of sound mind, I don't think. It's just so much for everything to take in that somebody in our family would do anything like this what he's done yes. is just just not right it's, it's un yeah. unrepairable we're so sorry for the families over there for, for the dead and the injured yeah we just can't think nothing else just want to go home and hide